Unity Live Event Lighting Episode 6, Animate the Movement of a Light. Okay, here we are in the scene, and the first thing I wanna do is turn off the canvas because we're not gonna be using it right now, and when I click this little button, it turns off the canvas so it goes away, so we don't have to worry about it. Remember, we have this spotlight mark where the light is going to be looking at this mark. So what if I wanted this little mark to move around, thus it's gonna move the light around. Go up to window, animation, animation, and it's gonna pop out an animation window. I'm gonna place it at the bottom here where I want, and it gives me a create button, okay? Because when you create an animation, it's, a, it's an actual file that, so you grab the game object you want to animate, okay? And then you go to the animation file area, animation folder area, and you're gonna click create. And now we get the animation timeline. I just have to hit the record button, okay? So it's live and it's gonna record my keyframes as I move the item around. I move the marker ahead in time, and then I choose another location. It automatically chose that location as a keyframe in my animation. And to add more time, I like to just slide a keyframe over. And as you can see, it goes by frames. So we have one frame per 60 seconds in this project at the moment. Now that I want to view what's going on, I'm going to stop the record button and I hit the play button and it's gonna play back what's going on. To make it loop, I'm gonna grab the first frame that I had and copy it as the last frame. Control C, Control V, I'm just gonna drag it over so then when it plays, the last frame equals the first frame so it looks like a perfect loop. I'm gonna hit play and we see that the marker is moving so the spotlight will, all, every frame, look at where the marker is. Thus, the light is animated. The light, it's too dark, okay? We need to change how bright it is. And we're gonna do that with the intensity. So I'm gonna drag the intensity up while it's playing. I can drag the intensity up and see where I want it to be. But what if I wanna change my intensity with coding? We're gonna do that in the next video. So check it out and give my channel a subscribe if you haven't, please help me out. That'll be awesome. And a like. All right, let's, let's roll the next video.